Steve, the character that you're playing is a dark guy, but we have no way. Well, we, of we're talking about get smart right now, right? <laughs> <laughs> we have no way of knowing how dark he. It seems like he's motivated on some bizarre level by some kind of need for validation sure. that he can't find. You want to talk about what's driving this this guy and why he's. What's driving Dupont? I th that's it's that's an enormous question. Um, I. I it's hard to talk about because, again, and relating to what Mark was saying, these are real people, and my my attempt at the character is really just that. It's my best estimation as to who this guy was and what was motivating him. And you you read as much as you can, and you watch as as much as you can, and listen to how he spoke, and 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 I tried to create it based on all of those elements and speaking to to people who knew him as well as they could. Because again, he, I think he was a type of person that didn't, he didn't have a very tight inner circle. I think much, many of the people who, who knew him were employees of his. So to get that, that true insight into who he was, a lot of it is just conjecture, frankly. Um, so what motivated him, I think, you know, his relationships with his family, I think, um, Inadequacies, inadequacies uh, that I think he he felt he had. He surrounded himself with these athletes, these champions, um, because that's what he aspired to be. He aspired to greatness, and he he fed off of that. He he loved being in the presence of greatness because I think he felt that that would um, sort of by osmosis make him that much greater. Um, but it's it's a it's a very very layered question, I think. It's hard to, it's hard to say. 